Wow, wow, wow. Cocky beans. This particular cocky beans I dedicated to Auntie Grace of Portugal for adding more tips to my research. So Auntie Grace, you can see Mommy when you take last class. The last time it was not really what I saw, but from your own, it was so nice. So I decided to do it this way. Oh my gosh. Yeah, so you see, I do it with little water. Then I just do exactly the work the way you told me. I wash my beans and it was not so long. Immediately I wash it, I drain it, then I freeze it again. Then I just move the next it and did exactly the way you told me to do. So inside is it is three cups of cocky beans. Then I put three eggs, then I put a little salt to taste. And then I put small white pepper because I love it so much. Then I put salt, then I put one pepper, then I put small um, leeks. So that is how it is and it was so nice. So I really appreciate your recipe. Yeah, so you see how the thing went off. So I'm preparing for my husband's birthday because it is a nice one. Wow. See how it looks. Wow. It's always good to ask questions. Oh my God, I'm so, so happy. Yeah, this is my first time to ever fry my aqua beans. I look so delicious like this. I asked my sister Grace, how do you do it? She explained it to me step by step. Yeah, and this is the result. So one, you shouldn't soak their beans overnight. Soak the beans, wash the beans at the same time. Then you plant it, don't put any maggie, just put only salt. If you want to put small pepper or you want any uh, uh, celery, you can put a little. That's it. It is wonderful. So nice. And if you see my mixture, the mixture is really thick. The mixture is thick. You see? Yeah, you see. The mixture is thick. So thank you, thank you, thank you, Sister Chris. 